All right, what's up? I'm going to take a look at another KISS compilation. Uh, the first of three of the 20th Century Masters. And this is also the point in time where I'm starting to, like, have a few of their compilations missing. Like, the KISS icons box. Um, and a lot of stuff that really it doesn't matter anyway. But I like to have it just to have in the collection. But I really want that KISS icons box. I missed out on that. And now it's, I can get it. I just haven't really tried. Um, I just like the design of it. And then I think there's a few others. Kiss Chronicles, that long box thing that has like the first three albums, which isn't really a big deal. And uh, what else am I missing? I don't know. There's a couple. But uh, yeah, for the most part, here on out from Sonic, well, it's other than Sonic Boom and Monster, we've got a whole bunch of compilations but that's uh later on we're going to be taking a look at the 20th century masters volume one the best of i thought it was cool when this finally came out why is it so blurry um i really like the 20th century masters albums i got a ton of them or had a ton of them i think i gave a lot of them away over time just copied them and put them away because i had like just the right amount of songs from bands that I didn't collect and I had the stuff that I wanted and it wasn't like some overblown like super added on to greatest hits or whatever it was just like you got the 12 11 12 songs and you were set and that's all you needed uh that didn't work for Kiss uh with this being the first one being the 70s I didn't it wasn't very special I picked it up, tad to the collection. Strutter, Deuce, Hotter Than Hell, Come On and Love Me, Rock and Roll Night Live. Detroit Rock City, Beth, Hard Luck Woman, Calling Dr. Love, Love Gun, Christine, 16, I Was Made for Loving You. Same old stuff. No big deal. You would have to literally have no idea or ever have heard a Kiss song, I guess, ever. Other than maybe Rock and Roll Night or Beth to want to pick this up and be excited about it. Um, but still, it is cool having all this and having new Kiss stuff at the time was really great. I mean, I, it, that was still the period where I was, anything with that logo or that makeup on it, I'll buy it. I got it. I gotta have it. I gotta have it, look at it for a day and throw it in a box and wait 20 years to do a YouTube video about it. Uh, <laughs> here's a CD. There's all the albums for the most part. It always was funny how they included the Kiss My Ass as official. I mean, I guess it was official, but it just, I, weird. Detroit Rock City, Box Set, and the very best of Kiss. There's really nothing else to say about that. Great cover shot, though. Uh, that's a good, good image. Kind of sticks out, I guess, along with the logo and the store. I'm not sure where I got this. When I got this, it was definitely around the time it was released. 2003. So, good stuff. There you go. Kiss. The best of Kiss. The Millennium Collection. 20th Century Masters.